Hey guys, it's Harley, and recently my mom and I made an order from taylorgreenhouses.com. We each bought about $45 worth of plants, which for me ended up being one, two, three, four, five, six plants from Taylor Greenhouses. The cool thing about their website is if you spend $85, you get free shipping on your order, and honestly, that's a really good deal considering how expensive plant shipping can be. So we ended up spending about $92 and didn't have to pay for shipping, which was awesome. Um, we were going to do an unboxing together, but my work schedule just didn't really work for both of us. So we're doing them separate. So I'm going to film mine now and my mom will be posting hers as well. So I'll link hers in the description box down below as well as a list of all of the plants I purchased. Let's just get into the uh, plants. Like I said, I was gone at work for the day when the order was delivered. I had it delivered to her house because she is home more than I am these days. Um, and she, um, she took them out of the box. But I have the box here. It's just full of newspapers. Um, yeah, it's just packed really full of newspapers. And then the plants come in three inch pots. Uh, with saran wrap and rubber bands around the outside, which I think is honestly really good packaging. Um, I don't know which video is going to go up first, but I also ordered from Hertz the same day I ordered from here, and at the dirt was, the soil was everywhere, the box was destroyed, it was really wet, like, if it had had to travel any farther, any further, then the box would have ripped open and all my plants would have fallen out, like, that's how soggy the box was. Anyway, that's a different video. But this one is a mother of thousands succulent. So as you can see, it has some babies growing on the leaves there. Um, but yeah, this one is really cute. I have been wanting this one, so I just thought might as well pick it up since they have it there. Um, I guess I'm going to like unwrap them as I'm going through as well. I think it's really nice that they put labels on all of the plants they ship you. So they just have this little plant label thing in here that they write what it is on. That's extremely helpful and not a lot of places do that. These look honestly pretty in pretty good shape. <laughs> okay, next up I ordered two string of hearts. I ordered the non variegated version and then the variegated version. Uh, these look really really healthy a lot healthier than the ones I ordered the one I ended up getting from Hertz garden um, And this one over here actually has a bunch of flowers and then blooms that are coming in so I'm really excited for that um, It seems like these are sold out seriously everywhere and then when they pop up I just like stress out and end up buying them. So now I have like six of them <laughs> Whereas two weeks ago. I have none I have none, but yeah, this one looks really nice, healthy and pink. So definitely the non-variegated one is larger than the variegated one. I just think that probably the variegated one is a little bit more popular, but I don't know, that's just like totally just me guessing, speculating. Um, have any of you ordered from Taylor Greenhouses before and what did you think? Because I've seen so many bad reviews about Taylor Greenhouses, but I've had a really good experience, so. Yeah, this one looks really nice and healthy. It's pretty big too. So next is the plant I was the most excited to order. And it is this Hoya. I have been wanting one of these for so long and they had one there. This one is a Hoya Carnosa Crispa. Variegata. That's a long name. <laughs> but yeah, oh my goodness, it is beautiful. This looks so healthy. Oh my goodness, it has lots of pink. Um, this, this one seems to be a little heavy on the edge. <laughs> but, oh my gosh. It has two little strands coming out. And it is honestly so, so pretty. I am extremely happy with this one. It's bigger than I, all of these have been bigger than I thought they were going to be when I ordered. So yeah, I'm very happy. <laughs> so next up, I got this Pelia Glocka, I think is how you say it. Um, I have just been wanting one of these to put in a hanging basket out on my deck. And I really love how this has the red undersides and then the green tops and it's so, so pretty. 
Oh my gosh, I love it. I just love how it gets really full. This one is very big and decently sized. So yeah, I'm really happy about it. Oh, it has lots of new leaf growth, which is awesome. Okay, and then last up, I got this tra Tradiscantia green and yellow, which is just kind of a basic plant. I just thought it was really, really cute. Um, it looks like there's a pink one in here which I'm a little confused by because I did order specifically the pink and yellow because I liked that color pattern a little bit better. Um, I do have a pink and yellow one already, not exactly this like this Trandiscantia, but I have a, another one. But, oh, I am not complaining. This one is really, really cute. Let's see. Oh my gosh, it is so cute and it looks really, really healthy. Oh my gosh, I was uh, filming the outro and I forgot that I forgot a plant. Oh my gosh. Okay, so here I also got a Hoya Cumingiana. I don't know how to say it, but it's just this really long, really leafy one and it gets really cool shaped flowers. Um, this one looks super healthy, like I said on all of them, and I am extremely happy about it. They have a huge variety of Hoyas. Um, that is really awesome. So if you're looking for Hoyas, I would definitely say head there. So as I said before, I was, when my mom said we should make an order together, I was honestly really nervous to order from Taylor Greenhouses because I have only seen and heard bad things about Taylor Greenhouses, um, and that they don't, if there's issues, they don't respond or anything. Fortunately, I didn't have any issues with my order, so we didn't have to contact them. One thing I will note Two things I'll note really quick. Um, if you order a plant and they have it out of stock, they will send you a replacement plant so it won't be the same one you ordered. If you don't want them to do that, then you can leave a note in the description box and they won't replace the plant. They'll just take it off of your order. Um, otherwise, they'll just send another random plant along and you'll just kind of <laughs> be surprised, I guess, which I think is a little bit weird, but hey, it's their their shop. They can do whatever they want. Uh, but just remember, if you don't want them to do replacements, if they're sold out of something, to put it in the note section when you're checking out. And then another thing to consider is that they ship on Mondays. So if you order between Tuesday to Sunday, then they'll ship that Monday. But if you order on a Monday, you're going to have to wait over a week to get your order. So, I mean, just kind of strategize there. My mom and I placed our order on a Saturday, so it would ship that Monday, and we ended up getting it. It shipped in three days, which is really nice, especially for free shipping. That's awesome. Um, but yeah, I mean, I had a really good experience with these guys. I am excited to see what my mom says about her order. I think that she was really happy with her order as well. Uh, but anyway, this was my experience. I hope you've had pleasant experiences with them as well. I definitely plan to order from them in the future. Uh, let me know what you thought of all of the plants I got. And thank you so much for watching. I will see you in my next one. Bye.